what is up YouTube so yeah I am actually doing this on a tablet now because I'm a little bit annoyed with my phone we won't even go there just dealing with this one step at a time um, so here's the video that I've been trying to do forever in a day and have zero luck with my phone so I'm using this now hopefully it works out great so here's what's going on I got the table done and it works out pretty good fills up drains keeps everything nice and moist and happy and uh, yeah and it's probably due for another one later on today the misters just came on got some jalapenos growing in here um, I think these are jalapenos too we don't know yet my ice cream beans doing good the sprinklers are still kind of dropping stuff I don't want to get this tablet wet um, my wife will kill me uh, let's see here uh, we got papayas growing my citrus tomatoes what else we got going on here I planted a bunch of different stuff uh, over there I got another citrus I think it's uh, blood orange maybe and over here I got my cacao this is my mandarin another pepper plant um, just more seeds more seeds more seeds cucumbers doing good though it's been doing I even got a little pickle I think maybe we'll see it might fall off well I gotta see if we got properly pollinated or not and keep looking for pest so yeah that's what's been going on folks um, this is my little stand here that I use it is what it is I put up all of this here shade cloth so I didn't have to worry about all the sun beating down on my plants all day so this is their safe haven I got a little light up there and that's for my air pump that little solar panel but yep and my workspace is disgusting don't judge me don't you judge me it's okay I can be dirty in my own greenhouse but I seriously got to clean it because I got ants and stuff coming in can't have that none of that nonsense so I'm gonna get it all cleaned up with the vacuum here in a little bit um yeah and that's pretty much what i've been doing um yeah let's look at the gardens outside real quick <sighs> this is like my first video i've been able to do in a while so transplanted my banana from over in the east garden um i got flowers coming on these cocktail tomatoes outside which is good uh turmeric's growing ginger garlic uh pineapples of course this is all my yucca. It is growing like mad. Um, let's see here. Really not a lot going on. I want to show you guys my crambola. It's, it's beautiful, that tree. I've got a child over there doing work. Okay, so here's what we got going on with the crambola. It's flowering. We're getting fruit. Look at that. That's awesome. I'm just glad to be doing this video. <laughs> um, more crumble. And this is why I believe it did it because I air layered it and I put it into shock. And whenever you put things like this into shock, they tend to fruit. So, moving on. Banana, bananas. I'm gonna have to move those two probably. Uh, let's see what else is going on over here. I need to cut the grass. I'm sure okay dragon fruit ain't gonna make it you know why because there's ants and pests and that's just my luck okay now I got to dig up this guy right here these banana pups um, another dragon fruit that probably won't make it that one won't make it this one's already done so there's pest in here so what's going on there's pest that's okay so I haven't been able to do one of these in a while there's the silk floss there's the silk floss tree right there seems to be doing well gotten big too it's gotten real big silk floss uh, Nope, I 
have one flower on this one and as you can see it too has succumbed to pest so I just toss it in a bed somewhere I almost hit a lizard wasn't even trying okay there goes one right there look at that guy these are the Jesus lizards see him oh, wait where's he at there he is right there there he is Watch whenever I get up close, I'm just gonna take off. Let's see. Let's see if I can catch him. Psst! No being all around. Or will he? Let's see how close we can get. There he goes. He took off. Alright. Ah, <sighs> hibiscus. Other silk floss tree. Ah. Aren't those pretty gladiolus? Alright, let's see what else we got going on. I really ain't got much. I really gotta cut this grass though. That dragon fruit took off some sort of way. I gotta make sure they do not get on that fence. Um my um, low quad ain't doing much. I air layered it, but I ain't got no flowers on this. I was waiting to see if I got flowers on it, but I don't think I'm gonna get any on this. No, that's okay. I ain't worried about it. Uh, that would be a mulberry. We're growing up big. Um, these are Chinese yard long beans. I gotta come off there today. Um, really not a whole lot of anything going on this side of the garden pretty huh my son's checking out the flowers okay let's go now I don't think I've done a video on the uh, ooh, pretty butterfly look at this butterfly um, I don't think I've done a video on my uh, cherry tree but I will got so much going on in the yard today check out this butterfly Pretty cool. Uh, yes, I gotta collect seeds from these. Um, I gotta fix all my plants, make sure they're all happy and healthy, and they're not. They look a little rough, so I gotta take care of that in a little bit. But here's my cherry tree looking a hot mess. Look at this thing. Looks like it's ready to pull itself apart, ain't it? I've gotten so many cherries off of this. Look, they're just laying on the ground. Cherries half eaten. The birds, the bugs, they all like it. But they're good sized cherries. These are um, Acerola. And for anybody who's just now getting to this channel, welcome. Uh, glad to have you. I grow things, lots of different things. And I'm here in South Florida. So I grow things that most people can't grow up north. I believe I'm in zone 10B. I'm far south. Not as far as the Keys, but far enough. I still get some frost. See? It's a pretty good cherry right there. It's pretty ripe. Pretty sweet. Hmm. Oh, yeah. And here it is. One of my favorite fruits. Mulberry. Now, this is supposed to be a mulberry tree. I keep it as a bush. I don't want it to be big as a tree, so I'm gonna cut it back and keep cutting it back. I'm never letting this thing get above what it is right now. For the simple fact that once it gets so big, you can't pick all the fruit, and then you got an issue because you can't reach all the fruit. So, and the birds will definitely get all your fruit. Look at this, there's a nice mulberry. It's a good textbook mulberry. Now, the Pakistani white mulberries, or actually, I think they're Pakistani pink, maybe, or just Pakistani. They're twice this. Hey, three times. No Surinams, not one. Spider webs everywhere, though. Tin can gardener, when you go and cut your grass, whenever I feel like it. 
I don't know. Probably drives poor old John crazy to look at my videos. With Will It Grow. And he's my team lead. And I know... Oh, I know there's a few other people out there. Probably looking at my yard cringing. I got pests in here I gotta take care of. But that's okay. I don't mind. I know I gotta mow it. I gotta get my mower going. Keep stowing belts. That's the reality of it. And uh, look at this pest. More pests. So I just squeezed that. Ooh, hog's weed. Yeah, this stuff, you gotta watch how you grab certain things. Hold on, I gotta pull this bad boy out of here before it really causes a plumber. If you look at this, those little thorns right there tear you up. And I got some sweet potato vine growing. And sweet potato vine, little fun fact, you can eat it. Some people know that, some people don't. Corn didn't do nothing. Again, I do have flowers on these patty pans, I think they are. But the thing is, I got more pests than anything going on in these bad boys. So I'm hoping I get something off of them. Even if I get one, I'd be happy. Um, one patty pan squash with enough seeds to replenish what I need. That's mainly why I did this, folks, for the seeds. And you see that? That squash bug? Huh. And these are Florida clovers. That's the clover we get down here, the type of clover. Black sapote, not so hot. Yeah, cut it back, move it, figure it out. Uh, been working so much on the greenhouse lately and had time to do nothing else. I gotta pull up all this pipe. I gotta pull up all these. All these gotta come and get moved and I'm redoing this. I'm revamping the whole thing. And sometimes you gotta do this. I got a new plant over here, just chilling. I gotta check them more often. I think I got a pepper over here ready to get pulled off of there. Yeah. It's a nice sump. Nope, look at that. Something was eating at it. I'll cut that out and eat around it. I really don't care. I guess Mother, Ta Mother Nature's always gonna take her, her uh, dividends. Look at this guy. I almost walked into that the other day. See it? That spider? I almost face planted into that thing how bad that would have been and I got a couple pepper plants over here but they're going in the greenhouse who am I kidding we know where this is going to end up and then I got this guy over here working hard hey where'd you get that hardware cloth huh? where's that from it was over there. I need that you remember that little tree you had over there oh yeah thanks look at this guy he's bringing me things I didn't even know I needed but I needed and then this is going to be the burn pile. And some of this is going out to the street. Can't burn uh, things like Brazilian pepper down here. That's a Brazilian pepper on the back of that palm tree. If you burn it, it's like burning poison ivy. And if you inhale it, you could possibly die. So not something I want to uh, test my fate on. But yeah, that's what's going on in the garden, guys. Got beans coming up. A lot of different things going on. I just did a full walk around. I'm pretty excited about this tablet. Now, don't get it twisted. I do. Here. Don't get it twisted, guys. I do have. If I can do this. Hopefully, this works. I do have um, ants all over my coffee. Awesome. Um, my camera, which I'm going to start using more, but not having a phone and the convenience of it's really pain because then I got to upload all my videos. I had a bunch of videos I got to upload, so don't think I've been sitting here doing nothing. Because I've been doing things. A whole bunch of things. So, and it's hot. So, I'm fixing to uh, get ready to go in the house. Have some breakfast, because I'm the last one to eat. I don't know why. Actually, lunch. No, I had breakfast. I didn't eat lunch. That's what it was. Maybe I'll have a little pre-lunch, a little brunch. Um, then we'll come back out here and start planting more seeds. So, we'll see what happens. 